This video is brought to you by Squarespace. There's a link in the description where you can get 10% off your first purchase with Squarespace. Hey, what's up, y'all? I'm Ten Hundred. I'm an artist from Seattle, Washington, and I'm here today sitting in my weird little room where I make weird little things, trying to come up with dumb video ideas that will entertain me and hopefully entertain you guys too. And I was thinking, man, what should I do? What should I do? What I want to do is just make a painting, but I've done that about ten hundred bajillion times. So this time, I think I'm gonna make a painting using only these things. That's right, it's a finger painting art challenge. Uh, using just my fingers no brushes. Oh man, I think you guys are gonna see some really bad art on my channel today. <laughs> but I need some ideas for what I'm gonna paint. So I'm gonna pop onto my Discord server here. And I'm on my Patreon Discord server. Hey y'all, I am making a finger painting video. I need some ideas of what I should paint. Come on, patrons, what you got for me? Maybe I'll pop this into my public Discord server as well. Boom. Finger paint some fingers. <laughs> An epic fight scene of jungle animals versus robots. Chicken nuggets that are riding motorcycles. <laughs> Spaceship. Monster. Self-portrait in your style. A deer on an adventure. These are all gonna be so hard to execute with just my fingers. I'm not worried about like the, the big chunks, but like the tiny little details I think are gonna be really tough to do. A post-apocalyptic scene or character with an 80s, 90s spin. Bob Ross landscape. A game Let's see what's going on on my public discord server. How about a clash of elemental forces? Lightning, fire, water, earth, elephant in a circus. There's a lot of crazy ideas, all of which I think I will be terrible at executing. Typing, typing, they're typing. <laughs> a monkey dressed as Woody riding a pit bull dressed as Buzz. Oh, what? What? An underwater ten hundy world of wonder. Oh, that'd be kind of cool. So far, my patrons are holding me down. An orc riding a mecha dinosaur into battle against against dragons. With my fingers? <laughs> With my fingers? This is crazy. Aliens playing alien sports. <laughs> Gaflega foosball. Hey, you wanna join me for a round of Gaflega foosball? Hell yeah, bro, that's like the best sport ever. A black silhouette of someone holding an umbrella, only the umbrella is blocking the darkness and everything underneath is sunny and bright. And then the next person goes, robot rabbit. <laughs> Animal Crossing painting, very hooked on this game at the moment. Dr. Robotnik. But skinny. Oh no, that's cursed. Do it. So I'm going to kind of narrow these down and try to make something. I don't know. Maybe after you watch this video, watch one of my other videos where, <laughs> where my art is not complete garbage. But let's see uh, how this goes and do some finger painting. <laughs> this is such a dumb idea. All right, so I got my canvas here. It's like 15 inches by 30 inches. I figured if I'm gonna be finger painting, I should probably work bigger just so that it's a little bit easier for me to do some of the smaller details. If I work small, I would just be super screwed. It would look even uglier than I anticipated looking in the end. I got some colors here. Green golds, fat orange, pyro red, titanium white, carbon black, your boy teal, turquoise thalo, kinacridone magenta, ultramarine blue, yellow ochre, and uh, uh, a little bit of brown. So I was looking at some of the ideas that they gave me and I didn't necessarily go with the best ideas. I went with ideas that I thought it might be possible for me to achieve just finger painting. So the idea that I went with, the guy who bezel brilliant said underwater scene. So <laughs> let's see what I can do with that. So I'm gonna start with some ultramarine blue because it's got the word marine right in the title. So we're gonna need a decent amount to cover this. So let's go ahead and just be real liberal with the gold and fluid acrylics, a little bit of turquoise thalo, just a little bit of white nip. Let's just dive in here. <laughs> oh, that feels so good. This is gonna be kind of satisfying. Oh man, we're gonna have to, we're just gonna have to dive in. I'm just gonna just throw some of this on here. So gooey. Now normally when I make art, I don't want there to be a ton of strokes showing and I don't really want the canvas to show through very much, but I might just have to let that go on this one. It's like giving a back rub. <laughs> Massaging the painting. Rotating, rotating, rotating. Come on. Yeah, looks like we made it. Let's just, let's get wild with it. There's some teal on there. Oh. Oh, oh baby, keeping it real with the teal. Oh, that is, that's pretty righteous, I gotta say. I'm like the new cast member of Avatar. Somebody get James Cameron on the phone. Well, dang. All right, let's let that background dry. All right, time to start painting. I think I'm gonna maybe try and do a big octopus squid thing. All right, so I'll just dive in here. 
Oh no, this is gonna be so bad. Big round squid dome here. Oh, you guys, it's so terrible. <laughs> it looks so bad. Okay, try and bring in a bit of shadow here. Maybe a bit of highlights. I'm sorry, everyone. I'm, so I'm sorry. Give him like some big bulbous eyes. Oh yeah, those lines are clean, son. That's a clean line. <laughs> Trying to do some like little highlights, but I can't. I can't make like thin, clean lines. Heavens to Betsy's. Time to start rocking some of these tentacles. Cause this is not a very effective way to paint. I will tell you that much right now. Tentacle coming out this way. Shwoop. That's how we make lines in the finger painting business, ladies and gentlemen. Tips and tricks here on the 10 hundred channel. I got you. <laughs> oh, he looks so terrible. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming. Just want it to be good, and it's just not even close to I was like, maybe I could make something cool with finger painting. Maybe this will turn out better than I expect. No. Nope. <laughs> no. Nope. Don't get your hopes up, bro. Oh, no. Oh, no. That looks terrible. I think I'm going to let that dry for a second. And just think about the poor life choices I've made. <laughs> Bring in some yellow here. Oh, yeah, baby. Super clean details, y'all. I got this detail game on lock. Oh, yeah. Dang, Ten Hung, when'd you get so good at finger painting? I gotta say, bro, I'm impressed. Squiddy, this Squiddy looking good. Well, thank you. You know, I have been complimented on my looks for quite some time. I'm actually a squid model. Big in the squid fashion industry. Something about this, uh, this area is just freaking me out. How dare you talk about me that way? I've been on the cover of Squid Fashion Weekly. You know how you have GQ? Well, in the squid world, we have SQ. And I am SQ's model of the year. So do not talk about my looks that way unless you want to get your ass tentacled. Cause Squiddy don't play. <laughs> oh, 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 somehow I got some black in there. That's not tight. Now, Squiddy, I think you need some funky little pupils. Now excuse me, good sir, my pupils are not funky. They are enchanting, they are mesmerizing. You can stare deeply into them, but funky is not a word I would use to describe them. Take it back. <laughs> Now, Squiddy, don't be alarmed, but I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try and clean up your edges here. My edges are perfectly fine, but do what you must. Come on, gently, gently. Oh, no. <laughs> this is not tight. Oh. <laughs> So bad. I wish I had tinier fingers. All right, now, Squiddy, I don't want you to be alarmed, but I'm going to try and give you some suction cups on your tentacles. All right, do what you must, but be careful. I will not have my appearance insulted any further. Okay, Squiddy, I'll be careful. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, Squiddy, I'm sorry. This will not stand. <laughs> carefully now. Carefully. There you go. Okay, you're doing all right. I don't know, Squiddy. Now just take it easy, nice and slow, nice and careful. <laughs> it's so janky. All right, Squiddy, what do you think? Absolutely atrocious. How dare you insult my beauty? Can I get just a dot of white in the eyes? All right, careful. Ooh, baby. Kind of do like a little fish here. It's your boy Fishbert. Come on, Fishbert. Work with me. Yeah, you know, man, I'm just here to give uh, Squiddy some emotional support. You know, he's a he's a real sensitive guy about his looks, and I just try to keep him company, and you know, try to try to be a good friend. And yeah, that's just kind of my whole mo. I'm Fishbert. Oh, well, that's very nice of you, Fishbert. I noticed that Squiddy is a little bit sensitive. Well, yeah, you know, that what are friends for? Oh, I got a big old crazy eyeball. I see you just added that. That is real unique, there, Ten Hundred. Well, I hope you like it, Fishbert. Tell you what, why don't you give me a few little bubbles coming up out my mouth? That'd be that'd be real, real cool, don't you think so? I think you're right, Fishbert. We got some bubbles. Hey, Fishbert, what if I tried to give you some some scales, some fish scales? Well, you can give it a try. I don't see the problem in trying it out. You know, never hurts to try. All right, Fishbert, bear with me here, bud. Oh God. <laughs> Hell yeah, Fishbert. I like your scales, bro. Thank you, man. You know, I'm real proud of them. I've been working on them for a while, and I think they're real shiny and blue, so I appreciate that. I really do. Tell you what, how about my friend Leroy comes and joins the party? He's another fish just like me. Maybe you could throw him over on that right-hand side there. 
Good idea, Fishbird. Oh, God, no. Leroy! Hi, hey, Leroy's here. Didn't join the party. Thanks for the invite, Fishbird. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. I'm just here to party, y'all. I'm Leroy, and you know, that's what I do. Partying's my game. Leroy's my name. A little eyeball for Leroy. Boom, I'm here, baby. Leroy is in the building. I got an eye. I'm feeling pretty proud of that. Dang, son, I'm looking good. Give me some bubbles. All right. <laughs> What is going on here? Let's see if I can get Fishbert Leroy's and pupils. Careful. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They got so much personality now. All right. I think I'm going to try one more. Got another canvas. I mean, I learned so many amazing new skills on that first one. I should at least put them to the test on one more. <laughs> I think I'm going to go with that Animal Crossing idea because the characters in Animal Crossing are pretty simple, so maybe I can do it. And also, most of you guys know what the characters in Animal Crossing look like. So when you do a side-by-side -side comparison of my finger painting to the original character, you can see how terrible at finger painting I really am. So that should be fun. <laughs> but first, it's ad time. This video is brought to you by Squarespace. Squarespace is an all-in-one platform to build a beautiful website, launch your brand, run your business, and share your creative vision with the world. I've been using Squarespace for years and years. My 1000art.com website is built on Squarespace, and that's like the center to my business, honestly. It's super easy to use. You don't need to know HTML. You don't need to know how to code. You don't need to be like a website builder, HTML guru dude. All you gotta do is take your awesome content and pop it into their beautiful templates and you're off and running. Those templates are award-winning. They're super clean. They're super classy and really, really, really easy to use. But if you do ever run into any issues, Squarespace has award-winning 24-7 customer support and they have helped me out in the past, that's for sure. So what are you waiting for? It's time for you to share your vision with the world. Every artist needs a super dope website. So when you're ready to start your free trial, go to squarespace.com and when you're ready to launch your site, go to squarespace.com forward slash 10 hundred for 10 percent off your first purchase boom baby build a website thank you so much squarespace for sponsoring this video all right let's get back to these finger paintings <laughs> yeah, da, da, da. all right we gonna throw in some some animal crossing sky blue oh that's juicy we're gonna make the perfect animal crossing paradise background son Blech. All right, so now I think we need some some green for some Animal Crossing grass. Oh yeah, this looks like Animal Crossing, right? Oh, that's nasty. That right there is nasty. <laughs> oh, that's nasty. Just a touch of yellow. Little little blades of grass there. Let's try and sketch this out. It is so hard to sketch with your finger. Oh no. <laughs> that's not frightening at all. This is terrifying. Oh man, I'm regretting doing the second one. <laughs> Oh, this is straight up nightmare material. Okay, there's my very unsettling sketch. <laughs> Trying to mix up some flesh tone here. Man, you freaky. I played Animal Crossing for about three days when it first came out, and I have completely neglected my island since then. Tom Nook is like, where are you at? Oh my gosh, this is horrifying. <laughs> Guy's just like, kill me now! Put me out of my misery! Y'all can never play Animal Crossing again without seeing this horrifying image. <laughs> oh, no! Finger spasm. Welcome to my first and last ever finger painting video on my channel. <laughs> oh no, look at how scary he is. This is like legit creeping me out. Maybe it will help if I paint his eyes. <laughs> no, that didn't help. <laughs> Not helping at all. All right, bud, let's give you some beautiful eyes. <laughs> no. Could have gone worse. Those are the eyes of a man who's $700,000 in debt to Tom Nook. Ah, Tom Nook's after me again. Where's my money at? Give him beautiful upper eye crease. Um. <laughs> and now he needs a nice, happy, pretty little smile. <laughs> I mean, I thought it was actually gonna be worse than that, so I'm gonna call that a W. I think he should be wearing like a cool 10 Hun shirt. <laughs> oh no, that looks so bad. Oh, the jank is real. This is about to be the next shirt I release on my website, y'all. Get your pre-orders in now. We are in full on epic fail territory. <laughs> this is just so, so bad. Just give him some little bit of embellishments on his shoes. Swaggy kicks, bro. Dang, what are those? Oh man, maybe we can use some satin glazing liquid to try and like add a shadow beneath him. Let's see what this looks like. Oh no, <laughs> this isn't gonna look good at all. <laughs> it's really hard to do glazes with your finger. 
It just looks so bad. Okay, there's a crappy little shadow. Wow, I really don't envision this getting any better, so I'm just <laughs> I'm just gonna call that done there. <laughs> just give up. Go on to paint another day. I'll never take brushes for granted again. It's time for the epic art reveal. Oh! Oh, that's epic! Damn, you went crazy on this one, Ten Hunt! I never seen art like this before! Oh, snap! Oh, snap! You killed it, bro! Damn, those are some giant paintings! Well, that's it for this one. Thank you guys so much for watching. I made these two absolute masterpieces with just my fingers. If you like this video, leave a like. Subscribe to my YouTube channel if you're not already, and you can even ring the bell if you want to know exactly when the next video is coming out. Man, I really hope this isn't a lot of people's first time seeing one of my videos, because I promise I'm a little bit better at art than these paintings might represent. <laughs> Thanks to Squarespace for sponsoring this video. You can check out my website if you want to see a bunch of my cool art that I put on to t-shirts and hats and hoodies and all kinds of sweet merchandise that I designed, 1000art.com. Links in the description for that. Thank you so much to my patrons. So, so much. You guys support me on a monthly basis and you make these videos possible and I super duper appreciate you. Well, that's it for me on this one. And now that these paintings are done, I think I have the perfect spot for them.